So yes, yes. As I said before, Fenty is for the girls, but Estee Lauder is for the women. Yes, yes, it's not greasy. It's, we love it, we love it. I love it, okay. I like the packaging. When I look at Estee Lauder's packaging, what I think is old money. So, and as far as the ingredients, we're getting that too. Yeah. I did find caffeine in this, which I said before, caffeine, when you see that in eye products, it's kind of like a, that's okay, because with it being a cosmetic grade, it's gonna be non-comedogenic, so it won't clog your pores. It feels like quality. It looks like a luxury. That's what it looks like, okay? And honestly, in my opinion, it was a little disappointing. Um, like I said, I want to talk about this um, Estee Lauder product. Mm. What's up you guys i hope you're feeling blessed and well today welcome if you're new i'm Brittany. this is Brittany jasmine mistakes trying to get in the right spot for you guys i had a few minutes and like i said i want to talk about this um estee lauder product mm. i've i've talked about a couple products so far it's a, many more that i want to talk about and i will be talking about in the future so if you enjoy these type of types of videos make sure you subscribe um but yes, the last product I talked about was the Fenty Overnight Gel Recovery Cream. I, I believe that's the name of it. I will link the um, link it up here, over here, wherever it's gonna pop up. If you want to go back and see that one, and honestly, in my opinion, it was a little disappointing, um, but it's still worth the money, and I explained why. So if you guys want to go back and watch that one, you can. But yes, this is the. Uh, Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Supercharged Gel Cream. It says Synchronized Multi Recovery. So yes, yes. As I said before, Fenty is for the girls, but Estee Lauder is for the women. Estee Lauder is giving the women exactly what they want and exactly what they need, okay? And this is what I mean by that. The packaging, I like the packaging. When I look at Estee Lauder's packaging, what I think is old money. That's what we think when we see Estee Lauder's packaging, right? So they have great packaging and um, you know, it feels like quality. It looks like a luxury. That's what it looks like, okay? So, and as far as the ingredients, we're getting that too. I can't even hold off y'all. I'm just telling y'all it is what it is. Allure Magazine awarded this, I think, in 2018. So, they were right. The smell of it is perfect. It doesn't have a smell. As I said before, that's, that's problematic when um, serums have smells or creams because it's just an unnecessary irritant for the skin. But, yes, it doesn't really have a smell. Let me show y'all. That's how it looks. Okay. The feel of it is perfect. It's like a gel, but the feel of it is perfect. It is a gel, but it is not that, the feel of the glycerin and like kind of gummy feeling that I felt like the Fenty product had. Yes, yes, it's not greasy. It's, we love it, we love it. I love it, okay. But anyways, Ooh, let me put the lid back on there. We can't be spilling this. As they lie, yes, it's giving the women what we want. That's what it's going. It's giving us women exactly what we want. So, we'll talk about the ingredients, you guys. Let me open my notebook. I have notes. There's no way for me to remember all this, y'all. There's just no way. If y'all are new and you want to see the suite, y'all can go back and look at my suite tour or my decor sweet uh decor update video okay uh no that's not it where are you okay here we go okay so 
This product was priced at $66, which I think is a great price point when you look at the ingredients and the amount in them, okay? So, Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Supercharged Gel Cream Synchronized Multi Recovery, okay? From looking at the ingredients, um, I didn't take the time to count all of them, but I did not see any dyes, any perfumes, or any scents that did not come from like flower extracts, so they were more natural. And I'm thinking actually, because I don't smell any smell in here, maybe those extracts were probably serving as more of antioxidants. I don't know, you guys, like I'm not a chemist. The, I'm not a chemist. I have not used this product for an extended period of time. This is just my opinion based off of the ingredients and what I found online. Let me go ahead and give that disclaimer. Um, so yes, the Sephora website, all this information I pulled from the Sephora website because this product was gifted to me from one of my clients, but the Sephora website has the highlights for this are good for anti-aging, hyaluronic acid, good for dark circles, and Allure's 2018 Best of Beauty Award winner, okay? So yes, uh, it's for all skin types, skincare concerns, it are fine lines and wrinkles, dark circles and puffiness. So I did find caffeine in this, which I said before, caffeine, when you see that in eye products, it's kind of like a temporary fix because it dehydrates the area to reduce the puffiness. But with this product, it did have caffeine, but it was more bottom towards the ingredients. And it has a lot of other things in there also that will actually help with like long term. So uh, the caffeine in this is not a negative thing in that case. Um, so yes, 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 yes. Unlike the Fenty, the first ingredient was not water even though it's a zero, so that's a plus, that's a plus. The first ingredient is methyl trimethicon. Okay, this is a very lightweight silicone. It evaporates from the skin, so it won't be absorbed and it dries fast, so it, that's cool. Like I said, it is silicone based, which is kind of, it is better than using the water, I guess, for, because like I said, that's probably why with the, uh, the Fenty product, they had to use the glycerin and the glitter 26 to thicken it back up because they started with the water y'all see what i'm saying so that's probably better off as far as for the texture and the fact that it is like evaporates from the skin the silicone is not harmful because it won't be like absorbed into your bloodstream y'all see what i'm saying so yes the second is bifida ferment lysate this is a probiotic ingredient derived from a specific type of yeast obtained by fermentation of bifida bacteria it helps prevent sun damage from exposure to uv light hydrates the skin and strengthens the skin's immune system soothes inflammation and reduces dry skin okay so this is found in number two so this is very good because the the second most um the second most is the second most prominent ingredient so this is a very good thing now to number three let's see are we at number three? Oh no i'm sorry y'all two was water the bifida ferment lysate was number three okay so at least two being water like i said it's not as bad as one was water in the uh, fenty product so Two was water, three was a bifida ferment, bifida ferment lysate, which is still a good thing because three is still a little bit higher up as far as prominence. Number four, dimethicane vinyl, dimethicane or vinyl dimethicane cross polymer. Okay, this is another silicone. It provides sensory stimulation for feeling a gentle effect of moisturizing ingredient for both the face and body. It's long lasting skin smoothing benefits and it can help with eczema. So. I think that's okay i mean we're at number four and this product has still given us more ingredient more better quality ingredients than than i saw on the ingredient list with the venti products so I, it's okay okay number five is propanadol it's a humectant and an emollient so basically it adds moisture to the skin moisture in um that's a good thing because if your skin is like well moisturized and hydrated it will help with preventative care for fine lines and wrinkles around the eyes six is petrolatum which is a cosmetic grade of petroleum jelly so that's okay because with it being a cosmetic grade it's going to be non-comedogenic so it won't clog your pores as bad so that's fine 
Number seven is sucrose, okay, which is sugar, a natural form of sugar that functions as a natural exfoliant and humectant moisturizer. Mild, it mildly exfoliates skin and draws moisture to the skin surface. So this is a good thing because sugar is an ex, a natural exfoliant and when you exfoliate to remove the dead skin, that also helps with preventing uh, aging and fine lines and wrinkles because it kind of promotes more cell turnover and then if you exfoliate and get the dead skin off your um, products will be able to penetrate a little bit deeper so that's a good thing that's why y'all see like they have like sugar scrubs because uh, sugar can be an exfoliant so that's cool that's cool that's cool next is number eight is algae extract which lowers the amount of oxidative stress found in the skin and it reinforces barrier function it provides soothing properties that can help alleviate dry skin so this is good you don't that the fact that it lowers the oxid oxidative stress um like i said it's gonna make the barrier function better and it will help with the uh, preventing aging this is what we want okay Next is Hypenia mesiformis. This is a secret ingredient that people in Asia have been using for years to keep their skin youthful. Um, so it's soothing and it's a barrier protection. And this is a, I've heard of this before of people using this like uh, in Asia as well as in Asia, I think the rice and rice water is a really big thing. And I think that's why some women who work like in the, are they called rice fields? I think so y'all, they usually have very pretty skin just from, like the being working in the rice you know see what i'm saying so um so yeah so that's cool if i'm not mistaken i think this is a little bit of i think this is pricey to get so for it to be a number nine that's still okay i, I don't know how much but i think it's a little pricey next is a uh, acrylamide which is a stabler and a binder so that's cool we didn't get our bind. We got a binder at number 10. Remember in the Fenty product, I think the binder was at number three. So that's still pretty cool. That's still pretty cool. So those are just like uh, up to number 10, you guys. Like I said, those are the ones that are most prominent in the ingredient. Um, yeah, those are the ones that are most prominent in there. So I'm not going to go any further past that. But they did have a lot of other ingredients in there that were great. Like I said, I saw some extracts that I think can serve as antioxidants, which is also really good for the skin. So overall, I think for $66, it's a great value as far as the packaging, the ingredients, and what it's offering. And I think it, you will see results from it. I, nothing is ever overnight with skin. But I think this will show results, and in my opinion, it will show much results faster than mm, the Fenty brand. Just my, in my opinion, based off the ingredients and the um, the amount in there. So, yes, yes. Let's stay louder. Let's give you girls what you want and what you need. <laughs> All right, y'all, that's it. I got to go ahead on and set up, get ready for my client. But remember to subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Like it if you want more like this. Go ahead on and be blessed, y'all. Bye.